Okay, so we've explored Canon's Photo Professional, blah, 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 for digital photo professional form. And that's pretty elaborate, and it's got some pretty nice features. Now I want to explore something that's a lot more simple, that is free for any Windows 10 computer laptop owners, and looks like they've made some pretty nice enhancements to it. And that is obviously Windows Photo Editor. And uh, the way you get to it is just open up their photos right up here. See, just photos, that's it. That's the name of it. And they've even added a um, they've added a video editor in here where you can you can't really do much with the color or anything, but you can trim it. But anyways, let's take a quick look here and uh, explore something. Let's start here. <clears throat> so this is kind of like a demo, just to show you exploring all the photo editing options out there because there are a lot of them, and uh, you know maybe you want to see what can do what. Now here, this here, I've, I've played with it a little bit. This, as you can see right over here, you got your basic filters like pretty much everything has. They do a pretty nice job. Um, enhance your photo, you just click this little wand and as you see, wow, that makes it look <laughs> it's pretty good. Now you come down here, undo all, if you want to see it, then redo. If you want to see the quick change. Now what I noticed here that looks like they've added and made it really nice, if you come up here to adjust, now right here, light and color. For the light, you can either start with the slider. Very nice. Same with the color. They got the slider. Or, or you can get into detail here. And this gets a little more into detail. Contrast, exposure, highlights, and shadows. Now you come down here to color. Clarity and vignetting. Uh, this actually isn't part of color, but clarity, if you remember on Lightroom, anybody who's messed around in Lightroom, that, this is an option that a lot of people really like. Um, vignetting, eh, that's pretty cut and dry. I don't really mess with that too much. I guess it adds a little artistic something to it. Now let's go up here to color. Now here, not a lot. I wish they had more. I wish they had the red, green, and blue. But, I'll take it, they, they got a little, you can make a little bit of a shift there. Got to have the warmth, I love that factor, or, um, option, not factor. And here, let's brighten this up with some warmth. Man. <clears throat> but yeah, this is a very simple, that's about it. I mean, they got this little spot fix here, which I tried and it actually makes everything look worse, so... That is not a winner in my book. That a uh, big fail right there. But everything else on here seems pretty good. Pretty solid, very fast, very easy. Not groundbreaking, but as you can see here from the original photo, and this is what I took. And then there's that. Oh, I'm being summoned. But uh yeah, as you can see here, very fast, very easy. Very user friendly. This is Windows Photos, uh, the editing software that's built in. So here's another option for you guys. All right, got to go take care of the kiddos. Hope this was helpful. See ya.